So a really big YouTuber literally just disappeared off of the YouTube platform and deleted all of his videos. Before we get into the video, hit that subscribe button and notification bell. It really means a lot. Chris in the Mike, a famous YouTuber, has over a million subscribers and recently just deleted all of their videos. And in his about me section, he put changes incoming. This is somebody who didn't just have a, you know, a couple thousand subscribers and just decided to give up. This is somebody who's been doing this since 2010, has over 14 million views and had a ton of videos and just completely de deleted them all. And on Social Blade, when I look, you can see where it dropped. Views for the last 30 days, 400 million deleted. So they either privated their videos or completely deleted them um, because they're nowhere even listed on here. And you can see right here the impact of like how much money this channel made. Off of those 400 million views, they made around a million dollars, maybe a little less. This is kind of the range, but still anywhere between 115,000 and 1 million dollars, dude. Off of YouTube, just the ads alone, not sponsors, just ad revenue. That's crazy. And not only did he delete his channel, but his girlfriend deleted her channel as well. She goes by Ashley Ossity on YouTube, and she as well deleted all of her videos, and she had over 200 million views on her entire channel. And Social Blade shows on here as well, 230 million views deleted. And on her About Me section, this was added. Ashley Ossity has retired her YouTube channel. Thanks for all your support. It, it's weird to me because it's like a couple working at a place and just deciding, you know what, we're done. We're going to walk off the job. Now, there could be a lot of reasons why either they've made enough money and they're happy and they're satisfied. I mean, th that's just the test of time. There's a lot of people that have done that. There's celebrities that have done that. Great example is there was a rapper named Maze back in the late 90s who made a few records, made really good money, and it was produced by P. Diddy and all that. And then he just decided, I'm done. I don't want to do this anymore. Look at Chris Tucker, the actor. He's another one that did a few movies, got really famous and rich, and then you just don't see him anymore. But these two, I don't get it. This was a money generator. <laughs> you know what I mean? This was the their job and they're done so there's a lot of scenarios that can happen here a either they um, made enough money and don't care anymore or B they're gonna wind up on the news and some sort of murder suicide which I'm not saying that that's what's gonna happen I'm just saying that it's a little mysterious and it's a little odd and it makes me think that I'm not gonna hear the end of the story that there's gonna be more to this I just think that there's something more sinister because that's what I like to think like you know I'm a huge horror fan so of course I'm thinking more sinister ooh they deleted their channels and now they're gonna go kill each other <laughs> but anyways if you like my stuff hit subscribe hit that bell notification hit that ding a ring a ling a ding a ring a ding check out this video over here and we'll talk to you later